Hey, KB family. So we're back again with another food review. This time we're gonna be reviewing Pizza Hut's brand new cheesesteak pizza. It just dropped, I think, last week. So we wanted to bring it to you guys. Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut and try it out. Let's see this? Look at that. What is this? It's the steak. It's their cheesesteak. Cheesesteak, okay. Pizza. All right. And as you can see, the crust, man, the crust looks really... Yeah, I got the stuffed crust. I never had that before. So, yeah, so the crust has cheese inside of it. So, all right. That'll be nice to try. Well, I'm going to turn it this way so we can, oops, excuse me, so we can get to it, open it up. Um, all right, let's dig in. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Looks pretty good. It's got cheese. I see pieces of steak. Um, wow. Mmm. So, Ooh, smells good too. If I'm not mistaken, so what the pizza has on it, it has, I think it's sirloin mm -hmm. steak. I see mushrooms. I added mushrooms. It doesn't come with mushrooms, but I added mushrooms. Okay. And then it has um, bell pepper, green bell pepper, and onions. And then for the cheese, mm -hmm. I think it's Alfredo sauce, and then the regular mozzarella cheese, I believe. And I think that's it. Yeah, so, so it's a it. it's a cheese steak style pizza. So be interesting to see what that tastes like. Here we go. And as always, I try to give you my honest opinion. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. I'm gonna give you my opinion of it. You know, I try to keep it oh. going. I have to put my cheese on here. I don't really add extra cheese to my pizza. I'm kind of happy is, with um, the cheese. It's just grated. It. It's from Pizza Hut. They do charge you for this. It's um, their grated um, Parmesan Romano cheese. So Okay. All right. Let's dig in. All right. It's good. It's good. Mm -hmm. As you can see, the crust. I'm sorry. It's a pizza. What can I say? Jeez. But as you can see, it's thin. It's a really thin piece of pizza. It's not thick crust at all. It's thin. Which is okay. I mean, that's fine for me. Um, cheese is good. Uh, you can taste everything, really. The mushrooms, obviously. Pepperoni. Not pepperoni. The, the bell pepper. Uh, the steak. Honestly, I haven't reached the steak yet on this piece. I don't know if you have. Mm hmm. Mm. It's good. Mm hmm. The steak. Now, is I'm gonna bite into the crust part. It's not bad. Hmm. Yeah. There's not. A, it doesn't seem to be a lot of steak on the pizza. Mm-hmm. That is correct. I was just gonna say the same thing. So I did taste. A little bit of steak but it wasn't enough for me to really get a good taste of it so i mean honestly if you're thinking this is like a like say a meat lover's pizza it's not that um like i said i have not got to i have not gotten to the steak yet there's one small piece of steak right here towards the back of the piece mm. but it's good. Mm -hmm. I did get some of the steak, and it's good. I mean, like I said, it's not a meat lover's pizza by any means, but I mean, it's okay. It's good, right? And my honest opinion is, I think they could have put a little bit more steak on it. That's my, you know, that's my honest opinion. There is steak, but it's small pieces of steak. And it's not 
you know, I mean, it's there, but I think they maybe could have put a little bit more on it. Now, I don't know if this is, there's a limit to the steak they put on it. Maybe you can ask for extra steak. Well, you probably can have an extra charge. Yeah. I mean, and the steak that's on it, it's good. It's tender. Mm-hmm. It's okay. I'm not a steak. I'm not a beef person. So, I mean, it's good, but I think if you really like red meat, then I think you'll like it. Mm -hmm. I love steak. So, it's great to me. I'm just saying, I believe they could have put just a little bit more on it. But it's good. And I wanted to point out that the, uh, the crust, right, mm -hmm. has cheese. Mm -hmm. There's cheese inside this. And it's really, uh, it's really good. It's really good. And as far as the sauce, because it's not a your typical marinara red sauce pizza, the Alfredo sauce and cheese combination is really good. It really goes good with mm -hmm. this pizza oh. and the bell pepper. The sauce tastes really good. And before I forget, we did we we did get some wings to go with the pizza. To try it you know these what are these called those are um sweet look, chili yeah they look very good and they smell good too so we kind of got this to go with the pizza yeah. but as far as the pizza goes like i said it's it's very good i just think there should have been just a little bit more you know steak on it and the crust the is the crust is really good Oh, it is. It's very good. But I was going to say, if I would have known, like, say if we order this again, right? I'll ask for extra steak. Say, hey, can I get some extra steak on there? And I'm sure they'll do it for a charge. And I'd be happy to pay the charge just to get more steak on it. But. Yeah, they're kind of skimpy with the steak. Yeah. But it's a good, it's a good tasting pizza. My tea. But yes, it's a. Uh, I think it tastes really good. And I like the. Mm, um, it is very good. This. I like the white sauce as opposed to the. Um, I really like the white sauce in comparison to the red sauce. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And maybe because it just works with this, but. But I like it. I would mm -hmm. get it again, and I'm not a big um, really steak person, but I would get it. I would too. Now. Mm, man, this crust is good with the cheese. That's in the thing. It's very, very good. Mm-hmm. Now, I'm going to try one of these wings. Bone-in wing. Or not wing. I mean, not wing. It's more like, it's a, like drum a drum act. But look at that. Let's see what it tastes like. Mmm. Wow. Wow. That's it. Very good. Kind of spicy. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. It's chilly. Yeah, it's it's got a kick to it. That's good. Kind of like a like a honey. Like a Well it's sweet chili, so maybe this yeah, maybe the sweet part is maybe it's honey. Yeah, it's got kind of like a honey sweet pepper plate flavor to it. <laughs> That's good. Very good. Mmm. Good, huh? Mm-hmm. I've never had these before. I've only had the the honey barbecue and the yeah, the honey barbecue. So these have of course because they have chill the chili has an extra little has a little kick to it, but they're good. And I have to say again with pizza. I have a tendency to eat up to the end of the crust, right? You know, to the back of the pizza where the crust starts. And that's where I'll put it down. I'll leave that. But man, this crust here is very good. It's got cheese in it. It's real soft and moist, as you can tell. See, I'm still eating. But it's very good. Yeah, the crust part of the pizza is very soft. Mm-hmm. 
It's got a nice cheese flavor. Wow. Like I said, the pizza's delicious. I just wish they would have put more steak on it. Now, let me ask you this. What would you give this pizza on a one in 10? I'd give it an eight. I'm giving it's not it's it's a good pizza. It's just I think they could have put a little extra steak on it. I think they're a little I don't know, they're a little stingy on the steak, but I have to agree. I'd give them an eight. Yeah. I'd give it an eight. I really like the sauce on it. The the white the Alfredo sauce with the um I think it's probably mozzarella cheese. Mm -hmm. The sauce is really good. And the crust is really soft. You can pick your own crust you can either get the hand tossed crust or the thin crust this is the stuffed cheese crust and i think there's one more that i'm missing but um but yeah and i chose this crust so so what do you think if you don't want cheese in your crust if you think it's too much like cheese overload then you can choose one or the other but you know crust. what it's not it's not it's not like cheese overload you know yeah, what i mean it's yeah, really it's, for it to be so much cheese, it's not cheese overload. Yeah, there's not really, honestly, there's there's not a whole lot of cheese in the crust. But actually. there's enough to, you taste it, you can, you can, it's soft, you know, it's there. Now, what do you think about the drumette chicken pieces? Um, They're good. What'd you give them? One to ten. One to ten. They're a little tough, the wings are very tough. I don't think so. I, I don't think they're tough. Not to me. I think they're a little tough, a little bit. So the sauce is good. I would give the wings because they're a little, to me, they're a little tough. To her. To me. To me, they're not. I would give the wings a seven. I'd give them an eight. Flavors, eight. Texture's good. They're not overcooked. They're not undercooked. They're perfect to me. But I mean, that's your opinion. Okay. You think they're a little tough? I don't think they're a little tough. I think they're fine. Just a little bit. Just a little. No. I think they're okay. Okay, so that's the end of our review on the cheesesteak pizza. I would definitely recommend it. Yes, I'd recommend it. I think it's sure. I think it's definitely worth a try, especially mm -hmm. if you're a steak lover and you really like steak. Just ask for extra steak. If you are a true steak lover and you want me, just say, hey, can I get some extra steak? Yeah, <clears throat> yeah. That was the only thing I would suggest is maybe asking for extra steak. Unless you don't mind there not being that much steak on the pizza. But, um, yeah. So, anyways. Make sure you like. Make sure you subscribe and share. And comment at below if you've had this pizza before. If, you know, if you liked it or not. Just, you know. And please, just leave, leave comments. We, we love to read the comments. And, yeah, we do. You know, and we will respond to them. So anyway. So anyways, until next time, till the next video. Bye. bye.